Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to the vlog and welcome back to another beautiful day here in Central Florida. Look at the weather. Oh, how nice is it? Today I'm going ultra light fishing, but before that, make sure you subscribe. Hit the like button, really. The like button helps us as much as anything right now, but I'm going ultra light fishing. And what does that mean? I'm gonna take out the single lightest rod I have and it's spawn season here in Florida and I'm going after fish. I'm gonna to head to my buddy's house. I'm gonna take just some Cinco's and this ultra light that's on a 500 reel, not a 2,500, not a 3,000, a 500 reel, and I'm gonna go fishing. here my buddy's house lake looks unbelievable ultralight time we'll see how we do there's a giant grass carp right down here now the water levels went down quite a bit and the water is crystal clear right now oh look at the bash right there oh my gosh I'm used to casting with two hands, and this rod doesn't have enough rod to, to make it two hands. So here's the goal, it's just, I think as I walk down here quickly, I think I'm gonna find myself down there, all the way down there with bedding fish. So we're gonna make our way that way and uh, look for beds. And if we see something, we'll pitch to it. Now again, we're just using a DOA Cinco to smoke today. And this is a little bit harder to, to work than I'm no, used to working. Usually I have a, a heavier rod. So I think I might have to be a little bit more aggressive with my movements. But we'll see how we do. A bite right here oh listen to that oh no off already oh no it isn't oh my gosh okay well <laughs> I don't know what I did wrong there I thought I set the hook pretty good uh, maybe I need to set the hook a little bit harder I'm scared I'm gonna break the pole is the problem identical cast. difference it makes on this oh we got off to look at that oh, what was that that made that much commotion that fast that's a lot of commotion for a fish Fun on this little ultralight. 
so much fun on this ultralight. I mean, it feels like I'm gonna break the rod when I do that. They're little. That's all right. He isn't, he's, I don't know, how big is that bait? Five inches for DOA? Well, that one wasn't getting away. I can tell you that. No, they're all small. Oh, look at them right there. There's three or four of them right there. Three or four of them right there. babies <laughs> sight fishing these little ones look at that that's not even as big as that bait look at that little one that one definitely felt that one hoping to catch a three or four pounder on this thing today I was really hoping that's fishing I really wanted to thump one that was a giant just to see what it would feel like on the A little bit better fish. Oh man, that's the best one I've caught today. And I didn't say much. That is not saying much. Maybe, maybe three quarters of a pound a pound. Well, I don't know what it was today. I went six for 13, one or two you'll see. I don't know if it was the rod. I don't know if it was me. This ultralight stuff, it's hard to feel the bite. And when they hit, I just am not feeling it. I don't know if the rod's not sensitive enough. Maybe I'm just not as good as I thought I was, which is probably true. You know something, you suck. But, still fun to come out during the week. Get a little time in on my friend's uh, Bass Blake. Catch some small ones and have some fun. So, do me a favor, subscribe, hit that like button, comment if you like this. Tell me what you think. Tell me if you think what I was doing wrong. If you know what I was doing wrong. If you want some of our prize packs, you can email us directly, info at fishinfloridaradio.com or go to our Facebook page, facebook.com slash fishinflorida, and we'll get you some of the prize packs. It takes a couple weeks, but just be patient. But until you see me next time, hope you have a blessed day. Take a kid fishing. Get your fish on. 
we will see you soon. Cheers, guys.